this is my desk. She is in need of a glow up. I have always wanted to have a super cute and aesthetic desk, like the ones you see on Pinterest. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you the process of giving my desk an extreme makeover. This is also your sign to organize your workspace because it makes a huge difference in keeping yourself motivated and productive. Uh guys before we begin with the video i just need to quickly announce that there has been a slight appearance change don't freak out <gasps> i have black hair again she's back you guys weren't supposed to see it yet i do have a video coming up soon where i'll be explaining this whole thing so stay tuned the first thing i need to start doing is online shopping for my desk my goal by the end of this video is to have the perfect study girl desk aesthetic so let's get started with the shopping and yes it is currently two in the morning let's make this short here's my shopping list this includes everything that i'm looking to buy for my desk today and here's everything i found and bought this is just a quick overview of everything i will be giving you guys a haul in a bit i did also want to mention that a lot of the stuff that i bought for my desk is actually from amazon and i'm not sponsored by amazon but i did create this amazon storefront where you guys can actually go and shop for a lot of the things that you're going to be seeing in this video i will have that linked below amazon if you're watching this please sponsor me okay so it's now been about a week since i ordered everything for my desk let's do a quick little haul of everything that i got Start decorating my desk we do have one more purchase to make i am so excited right now can you guess why you probably can so right now i'm actually on my way to the apple store because i'm gonna go buy myself an imac <laughs> this is literally so exciting for me and i obviously have to bring you guys with me this is surprisingly not an impulsive purchase and this has been something that has been on my mind now for the past year i just know that this purchase is going to be so good for me it's going to make my life so much easier i can see myself being more productive i'm actually going back to school next month so that's going to be a big help and my job is basically social media so all of my work is on a computer my little macbook could only handle so much i can see myself getting super stressed if i don't get a bigger screen to do my work on soon i can see this being so good for my youtube channel because i just know that when i add this computer to my desk i'm going to be more motivated to actually sit there and edit i've actually never owned a big computer like this i've only ever done my work on a laptop which i've honestly been fine with and honestly the fact that i have been saving up for this imac for the past year now makes me so much more excited to buy it so you guys are gonna come along with me i did place an order for this i have to go pick it up right now and before i tell you which color i bought go guess in the comments which one it was let's go pick her up I did end up getting the pink one. I feel like that isn't surprising. I just know she's gonna look so cute on my desk. And okay, I do not want to keep talking. Let's open it. So this is now the fun part of the video where we begin setting up the iMac and decorating my desk. I like how as I began to put my desk together, I started to realize that I unintentionally went for this white and pink theme. Anyways, you guys can watch me begin to decorate my desk here. my apartment 
apartment, I am trying to avoid poking holes in my walls at all costs. So I got these like pegboard thingies that I'm just gonna put behind my desk. I'm able to actually just stick these onto the wall. It basically makes it so that I can hang little shelves on here. So if I wanna hang anything into my walls, I can literally just put them into these like little folder thingies. You guys will see what I'm talking about and hopefully it looks cute. So next on the agenda, I don't know if you guys can see there, but there's like a blank wall moment going on here I wanted to decorate it So I actually put together a bunch of prints that I thought were really cute and I actually went to go pick them up at FedEx today I'm gonna be cutting these out and using them to decorate the wall up here Another thing that I also did was I created my own little calendar I know I'm kind of extra for this But I really wanted to spice up this calendar that I had gotten and these are just gonna match the aesthetic that I'm going for my desk so much more. So because I can sense the comments, I already know I'm gonna get a million questions asking how I did this. So let me quickly show you. I was thinking about how I really wanted to have a cute calendar above my desk, specifically a calendar like this. I swear I've looked all across the internet for a calendar like this and I just can't seem to find one. So I decided to take matters into my own hands and I'm gonna be attempting to design this calendar on my own. So let me show you guys very quickly how I am gonna be doing that. I did use Picks art for this on the computer. Basically, I took the measurements of my calendar and input them here. Then I went onto Pinterest and I saved a bunch of cute background photos. I dragged them onto this blank image. I messed around with the sizing of the image. Then I just added some text, typed in August because that is the upcoming month. I added in this square shape, then lowered the opacity on it. I went back on Pinterest. I looked up a printable August calendar, which I then saved and also dragged on top of all of the other images I had already added. I cropped it. It, and that was literally it. I repeated this for all of the remaining months of this year I am gonna have to go out to FedEx very quickly to print these out But before I go, I did want to look more through Pinterest for maybe some little posters that I might want to put up on my wall So I could just go and print them out now I saw how I did that. Let's resume with the decorating. so cute. I'm getting so excited. I feel like something is missing right there and I'm still not sure what I want to put up on this pegboard yet. I'll figure that out later. I might change these up. Next, I did want to add some more things to this little corner here. I feel like it's missing something. lamp look better when it's on the table or when it's on this thing? Let me know. Next, I did want to add some crystals to my desk. In case you guys are wondering, these here are supposed to help with enhancing your productivity, focus, and creativity. Especially tiger's eye. This one is really good for that. This is what my bed is looking like right now. It's a huge mess. I literally have been throwing everything on here. I still have things on my bed that I'm gonna put on my desk. But before I continue, I do wanna clean this up really quickly. Oh, 
the final touches that I wanted to add to the desk was actually some LED lights. I'm gonna be sticking these around the entire desk so that in the nighttime, the desk is gonna be super vibey when I turn these on. Let's stick these on really quickly. makeover i'm actually super proud of the way that she turned out here are all the cute pictures i took of her and the final results of my desk she came out so cute i love the fact that i unintentionally ended up going with this pink and white theme Honestly, my favorite part of the entire desk definitely has to be my pink heart chair. I haven't talked about her much in this video because she wasn't new. I actually got this chair months ago when I did my room makeover last year. I know I'm gonna get a ton of questions about it, so if I could find a link for it, I'll have it in the description, but I love how it fits perfectly with the whole theme that I have going on here. I'm not kidding, I'm staring at this desk and it feels like it is straight out of my Pinterest boards. My literal dream desk. I do still have some empty spots on my desk that I'm just gonna leave for now because as time goes by, I'll put things in there. Also, above my desk is super empty. I feel like a shelf maybe would be really cute. But for now, I really like the way it looks, so I'm just gonna leave it as is. Also, some of you may not know this if you haven't already watched some of my previous videos, but I am also planning on occasionally using this desk to do my makeup. So this side of my desk is actually filled with a bunch of makeup. Anyways, here's what my desk looks like at night. <laughs> And once again, I wanted to thank you guys so much for supporting my channel because I would not be able to do stuff like this without you guys. I just know that after making this huge effort to make my desk look this cute, I'm going to be so much more motivated to actually get my work done and be productive because I'm actually going to want to sit at my desk. Like, come on. Look at how cute this is. Tell me you wouldn't want to sit at this desk for hours. I'm so grateful that I even get to experience having my own desk because up to this day, I have never had a desk of my own. I have always shared my desk with my sister. So this is nice. I am officially so excited for back to school and all the cute aesthetic back to school content that I have coming for you guys. Just make sure you're subscribed and have your post notifications on because I have a lot of juicy back to school content coming up in these next weeks. That is it for this video. Love you guys so much. Hope you enjoyed and bye. Oh, 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 oh,